I want to keep an eye out for the first scrambler. He'll probably catch the calf and take him across the line. If he does, he gets to come back for the super scramble on March 19th. Now, Andy Seiler. Thank you, Bobby. I was patiently awaiting that introduction. But I want you to know that we have 14 young men and 16 young ladies who are also patiently awaiting their opportunity for our sixth calf scramble. Patty, which one is the most impatient might catch one? Well, I don't know. We had a lot of kids. I talked to all of them. Some of them are athletic, some of them are philosophical, but a lot of them have done this before, so I'm expecting a pretty quick scramble. Let's meet the kids, starting with Brayden Raven. Avery Moss. Brayden Caps. Alyssa Bruner. Madeline Frederick. Sierra Wanick. Connor Brantley. Kaylee Jackson. Jamonte Q. Sergio Hernandez. Madison Gary. Madeline Addington. Landon Melton. Elliot Throckmorton. Connor Oliver. Wyatt McCann. Logan Woodruff. Madeline Glaze. Harry Rankin. Braden Flightman. Caitlin Hendricks. Kimber Sebesta. Annabelle Lindsay. Ashlyn Martinlock. Brayden Steinbecker. Mallory Fitzgerald. for the 6th edition of the 2023 Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo. And as is customary, we welcome two special guests, one to open the gate, one to drop the hat to let our scramblers know when it's time to get going. Our gate opener for the calf scramble is none other than Sunny 99.1's morning show host. Let's welcome Dana Tyson. And our calf scramble starter is the president of Rice University. Let's give it up for Dr. Reginald DeRoche. So what Dr. Reginald will do is drop that hat to let each and every one of our kids know that it is time to go catch a calf. As we swing that gate open, Dana Tyson will help us in doing so, so that the calves can go towards our 4-H and FFA exhibitors. That hat is being held high in the air by the president of Rice University. Once it drops, it lets those 4-H and FFAers know it's time to go. Let's catch a cat. And the cats are off and running and look at the kids. They are giving chase. I told you we had some athletic kids out there showing their speed now. That is just step one. Catch the cap, then you put the halter on and bring them back to the box. Look at number three, they're breaking caps from girls in that cafe. Drives the lucky horse to his first cap scramble. Oh, he's had a purple on there. Purple right over number 29, sir. <laughs>
<laughs> Young lady steps in next door and gets that one. There's Dash Frank in the end from the Calderon, number three. You ran all the way over there and then stopped. So you kept running. You get a great shot of her opening that halter up so that she can put it on the cab. There, see, she double checked, but okay, this is how it goes on. Whoa, whoa, don't let it go. Gotta put the one rope underneath the nose, the other on top, and then tighten it up. Thank you. 